after trauma, you are not just going to recover. You have to use the right tools and have the right attitude in order to get to a new place. It doesn't just happen. And that's the place that most people get stuck. They somehow believe that if they just give it enough time, they'll start to feel better and that everything's going to be okay. But let me tell you, I've seen really good people, people who are really smart and dedicated, get stuck in this place because they'll start saying to themselves, yeah, I should just be okay now. And with trauma, with PTSD, with post-traumatic stress, with these extreme feelings, it doesn't just go away. You need to apply certain key factors. And believe it or not, one of them is simply having an understanding that you must persevere. You got to own it. And actually know that these symptoms, these things that you're feeling are real and that that's okay. Once you've really committed to them and understood that these are real, real things that you're struggling with. The, the, the feeling of anxiety and stress, the, 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 the desire to avoid things you used to enjoy, the, the jumpiness in your body, the, the sensation that you know, things are not right, that you're not sleeping well, and that, you know, you're, you're believing really negative things. I want you to know what is true for you right now so that you can recognize the areas that you have to apply yourself to. But more important to that is a sense of perseverance. I want you to really know that whatever the symptoms are, if you continue to apply yourself over and over again, over a long period of time, and you are using the right approaches, these symptoms lessen over time. For more Ask Dr. Anna videos and information about post-traumatic growth and recovery, subscribe and like our YouTube videos at What is PTSD? Or join us at previous video episodes in our playlist, Ask Dr. Anna from the Traumatology, Traumatology Institute, Institute team. team.